Hello, my lovely Leo. How are you, loves? I hope everybody is well. Leo, welcome to your weekly reading. This will be for the third week of November 2020. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs, and Venus Signs for all of you. Take what resonates most, loves. Leave what doesn't. As you always know, I may speak directly to you and deliver a full storyline. And sometimes I may speak directly with a cross watcher or somebody you are dealing at this time or in regards to the situation you are dealing. All right, loves, let's hear what we have for this week and how this affects, benefits, or what the energy is for you. And we have best independent. Your independence is a foundation for your strength and success. For some of you Leos, picking up the single energy, but very much bold energy. Yes, loves. Like you feel like, well, it's quite that energy like if I don't have a good person in my life, a loving person in my life, I can be by myself long time and underneath here we have undying love the love you have shared is eternal regardless of the situation and for some of you you might have in your energy somebody from your past and you might feel like well if that will never be something here which good I'm good the way I am. Let's see here what it is, loves. Let us see here. Also, I might speak directly here with a Leo who is a who is a good professional, who is in that area of not all, all not only that I'm a good worker, but I am really good with what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. This is the path I am. Could we work? But let's see. And overall energy for the lovely Leo, we have Moon and Page of Wands. It's like, you know what I'm seeing you? Good communicator, good of what you do, but there is a soft side of you. And that's come even from your childhood. And for others of you Leos, might be the energy here, a mother or a father give it to you that you might not be good enough or you might not be able to do something in your life great or big. And that comes from a young Leo, from a young age. And that's quite a fear, like I want to show real but there is a part of me that it's still shaky or insecure or soft because I see here uh, around me, around your energy, Leo, it's a hard shell, you know, it's like a egg and inside has the yolk and that's kind of like the hard shell and the inside the softness. But let's see here, Seven of Swords. Three of Swords and King of Wands. For some of you, you kind of eliminate a lot of energies which you have felt is not good and become who you are today. You might remove a lot of people who are quite negative or hurt you or have been in your life just by their own interest, by their own good, not your own good. Hierophant, King of Swords, Sun, Ace of Wands, Nine of Wands, and Queen of Cups. We have here a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I have Taurus, could be another fire as you are. But I see here, there is something here you, you let go and there's something new coming up for you. 
but it's quite a mystery where you you feel like I'm not sure if it's the right thing to go but seems very promising seems very very promising but let's see King of Swords you might be here in some commitment with this air sign I see air and water into your energy you might be somebody who has a lot of things on the shoulder and you might need to try to take things as they are king of swords picture me in here magician four of pentacles and five of pentacles yeah there is feel a lost in regards to this person but this person might might feel the loss more of the money if you've been with somebody here and you know you just need to send them love and and you know peace is this person because this person is struggling yeah they are struggling and could be an ex of yours but the thing here is struggling because it's kind of they made their situation the way it is not you because they they walked away from a commitment you have marriage whatever it's kind of they, they, they thought the grass is greener on the other side or they can make it better. But in the fact, they, they lost. Queen of Cups, speak to me. Nine of Pentacles. Five of Cups. Eight of Swords. Two of Pentacles. Judgment. And Page of Wands. This person doesn't feel like you you will be with them. This person is single. And it shows me here that is in your path forward. And they do recognize who you are for them. They might have been through a lot of BS crap in the past. Here. Yeah. But they don't feel like that might be something here between you two. It's like they have doubts. You, Leah. What is here for you? Knight of Wands. Chariot. Nine of Cups, wow. And Queen of Pentacles. Six of Wands. Very positive energy here for you, Leo. I feel here you enjoy travel, you enjoy your money, you enjoy your, you know, your, your wild energy here because I feel here is like I love the life I have. I love the way it is. And I do allow a lot of things here. But in love, I'm I'm quite not sure. It's either you you lost the trust here or you've been hurt prior in love. because i i do see you very busy with your work money wise the movement for you it's great and there might be this person coming into your life but 
but you are not sure or that person most likely is not quite sure because they have the 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 um, I'm not good enough it's like what they show to you I'm confident I'm good it's pretty much what you show as well but on the other side they feel like I don't see if this connection will go it's like they from the first doubting it it's like I doubt that this connection is moving forward or will move forward because you are something new for them talking to them seeing them and things like that and you don't really know let's see here one advice for you king of cups and two of cups and Leo this person might be your life partner if you go deeper into this connection in this love because came up with two of cups right here so yeah mama thank you okay. so here we are Leo with this love and the advice is very much go ahead you will make it so loves I wish all of you a great week ahead and don't be afraid to take that leap of faith love and light because I have a little energy here my little daughter coming here and visiting me here and we'll see you next time loves many blessings namaste